play at the ledge. What if you tried to uh, just capitalize on the hole you're on it, roll behind? Does that hurt? Uh, no. No, 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 no. So it only hurts him if, it, if he shields. They shield. Okay, yeah. that makes sense. Okay. All right, boys. All right. Yeah, now it's going to be right. me and Schrader hour. All right. All right. So 3D, it was a pleasure commentating yeah, with you. Rematch. All good. Yeah. We're, yeah, you missed a lot of top 16, dude. My boy. Nah. Nah, we're doing adult. Nah. Welcome. Gotta keep it real. Welcome. Double. Welcome. First time, man. First CFL SmackDown First Ultimate. Ultimate baby. It Me and my boy so Dwayne. It does feel good, Dwayne. Is that do what? Okay, we still got Polonian. We still got Polonian up there. What are yep, you, got, you, got him, you got the bar. You got Ewok. You got the bar there. I, I almost made top 16. Oh, really? I was close. Last. Who did you lose to? I lost to Meow Mix. Oh. Meow Mix. But, are um, you still going to Pichu? That's what I was uh, I did go Pichu, but I also went like four other characters this bracket. Okay. But um, Ewok, my man. Still watch me we're, we're, we're Pichu mains. And so That's I cool. saw him sitting down. I said, at least I'm out in time to it's commentate this. No, this is and to watch it. Because I learned so much new stuff when I watch Ewok play. But we're going to see what happens. Because these are actually two characters I've been playing a lot. I've played both of these in bracket. Uh, okay. Palatina and Pichu. The good thing about Pichu is that he's so small, low profiles, everything, and he can get in. Yeah. Uh, and that is a good thing against a character like um, Palatina. Like Palatina. Because think about it. Like, Palatina has some good hitboxes, but, you know, once you, you can be whip punished. Let's just say that. So Pe Pichu also doesn't have quick attack cancel. Against he him, invented right? that. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Um, no, no, no. He doesn't have quick attack cancel. His okay. upbeat does not have a hitbox. Okay, so that is true. All right. Um, yeah. But Sunder comes out, I think, faster. It's way more powerful. Okay. Uh, so and uh, this, is, this is the big difference between Pikachu and Pichu. There's a lot, but yeah. uh, they're, they're not similar characters. I'll tell you that right now. But a okay. big one is whichever direction Pichu is facing, that's where the Thunder hitbox will hit you. Okay. It's not the same with Pikachu. Pikachu you have is to just whatever side you're on. Right? Whatever side you're on. So that that's huge. Because that say is, even yeah. if you DI behind him, but he faces the right direction that he wants to yeah, go. Yeah, you're still going that you're way. You're dead. Okay. Yeah, no, exactly. that's good. That's actually great. Yeah. No, no. Pichu is one of those characters that he's such a glass cannon that it's it's cool to see him succeeding this early on. Yeah. Because this character might be one of the biggest threats in Smash Ultimate. At least for now. But so is so is Palutena. Talk oh, me about for him. Sure. You know, I mean Palutena is just kind of insane now. Like basically they fixed a lot of her hitboxes and now you take away all the landing lag from her aerials. Ooh, she's insane. Also explosive flame, um, I believe you've got a huge back reduction, which is the reason why you're gonna see a lot of combos and option coverage with that dude. The only way you're gonna really punish it is if you got her around it already and then you're just ready to hit her. Exactly. If not like you see it, like wait, what's this fire? You're not punishing. Yeah, yep, yep, yep. And it's great for shield pressure. Unless you parry that, but you have to parry like 20 moves at once. Yeah. Alright, on the ledge this is exactly where Pikachu oh, thrives. Wait. He was looking for the early um the early recovery there. He would have been able to get a spike, but the Pokemon would have killed. That's okay. Keep the pressure going. If he gets an up tilt there, he can follow up into a top air into a down air after that. Yeah. Alright, get it back with a thunderbolt. For drama oh, though, man. okay, I was gonna say that should kill. <laughs> yeah, and that's the thing, man. He shoots in his own weight class. Oh, that could have been a thunder. I think it might have been a little too low. Oh no, up tilt thunder. You can get an up tilt thunder at this percent. Let's go looking for it there. Yep, he applied the pressure with the jolts. Oh, the other thing too, is this Thunder Jolt at a different angle than Pikachu's as well? Uh, I'm not I can't, sure. I can't have to look to do that. Okay, that's something I gotta look at. Because like right now, I really like how it's like almost, it's like an 85 degree angle. It's super, super oh, different. Oh, oh, okay. Forward. So, cool thing you can do right here is uh, forward throw will kill eventually. Uh, and then, so if your opponent DI's in, you can actually down throw into a Thunder. So it is, it's, it's interesting you get the specific percent, excuse me. Well, that's good to know about. Definitely, you gotta you gotta abuse everything you can get off of throws in this game. It's not too many characters have a lot of throw combos going in. So knowing those DI mix ups definitely turn out. Oh, that's yeah. and that would have been early stock if you got hit by that. So I think there's a few things that people still need to lab. Uh, in certain situations, you could go for a chase down thunder if you hit people up at percent like that we saw it up there. Should be a good amount of percent. No, it's still super early percent, so you didn't want to go for anything big. You can do a three up airs and do a forward air. That will be your like max combo percent, early percent. Okay, nice DI there, chasing away. It's great frame data there, spot dodge, and that's a back air. Oh, we got down out of it. Yeah, but that's okay. You know. Oh, that's kind of dope. 
Oh man, he had the call out on that. Uh, still gonna die on the range. Right, here we go. Down throw. Percent. That's big damage. And, and I have to say that so far it's looked like that he walked. Oh, there, there. See, that's the 50-50 right there. See, he already spooked it. But it wasn't at the right percent for you to get the spike hitbox from the thunder. It was a little too low. So, okay. uh, I think it's like around 100 or something. Uh, but you know, we've been seeing Ewok has been coming back ever since the first stock. And look at him applying all this pressure. And it's difficult for Prince Robin to actually get out of the pressure. This is where Prince Robin wants to be. Yeah, just all that neutral right there. Man. Now, although Paltamo's uh, moves are great, but they don't really have the fastest um, startup to them in the world. So, yeah. That's Which is why you see a lot of those aerials. Ooh. Oh, and that's a good. That's a holy light, man. Yeah. I sent you straight to heaven. Uh, into the atmosphere. That's all I care about what I'm just saying. <laughs> so, I mean, definitely, like, I feel like one of the big struggles with Pichu in this matchup is that as long as Palutena is throwing out moves, it's really, it's gonna be really hard for Pichu to contest with them. Like, he's just gonna walk in. He's gonna take all that damage. I don't really think he's got the moves to trade. Like, he's got, he's got a lot of great multi hits. But I don't know if he's got any moves that can just like outrange that. Palutena yeah, has. that's true. That's true. Nair is usually your option to get out of trouble. But you want to be careful because every percent you're taking as Pichu is a, like a good fraction of the percent closer you are to death. Yeah. You know, and this is, this is a game where like explosive flame, they'll probably kill Pichu at like ninety or something. All right, I surprised. if you can jump out of that combo right there, Ewok was going for uh, a little bit of mix up. That's a low kick. We coined it. A low kick. A low kick. The low kick. Forward, uh, her forehead. No, the four tilt. Okay. That'll also <laughs> kill you uh, 120 near the ledge and 150. 120? Yeah, 150 oh, wow. uh, anywhere else. Oh, that's good to know. I think you got buffs everywhere. <laughs> yeah, and, and but, you know, the character still hurts itself. So, oh, yeah. No, I think it's perfectly fair. Ooh. Oh, man. That, you that's are right. Another yeah, 90, great 90 was the magical percent for this. Oh, this uh, top last one is, I think, the tallest out of all of our legal stages now, too. Yeah. That's crazy. So this is a good percent for you to go for a Nair there. Uh, weak hit in Nair uh, will uh, allow you to try to go for a, a jab lock, which would kill on spread. And now he's looking for the up tilt. Uh, another fun fact is the up tilt thunder confirm will only confirm uh, if you hit the up tilt in front of you. Right there. Okay, I remember hearing about that. Yeah. Right, good stuff. All right, calling it on right there. Yeah, I'm glad. <laughs> See, there's no such thing as commentators' curses when you're from the same region. You know, there's always a blessing. I was going to say it was a blessing. <laughs> yeah, but, but the thing about blessings is that Chris Robin plays the blessing incarnate. That's true. I mean, we are finally blessed with his presence again after yeah. so, so, so long. Yeah, it feels good, man. It feels good to really to see this, especially, like, you think about Ewok, who's always played, like, Cloud. Yeah. You know, and now he's playing this little guy right here. Hey, 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 who's a Lucas man? That's, that's, that, that's a record he wants to put on his book. <laughs> also, I have to admit it, I think the most thug character in this game is Pichu. I agree with that. Like, like all his hats and stuff. I was about to say, the hats. He's a gang affiliated <laughs> man. He is, get on the Aqua Magma, I think. I think, I think there's a there there's no, team on There's there. no Magma, unfortunately. There's a Team Skull and an Aqua. What's the Redhead band, though? Is that Team Flare? Uh, that is a Focus band. Oh, that is? Yeah. Okay. I, I think it is. Oh, yeah, 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 because that was in PM. Oh. Yeah, yeah, you don't want to drop shield there. That is the classic Palutena. And look at that, man. That's the, the kind of coverage. Oh, that could have thundered. That's, that's the thing. Say, yeah. I was thinking we that don't was know those confirms yet. The character's so new, and so it's like, uh, you know, we might have seen it once or twice and done it once or twice, but reacting? Yeah, it's like believing in it entirely. It's like, this is literally our first weekly, so it's like, this is just whatever people have practiced within either two weeks or three days or four days. Yeah. yeah. Like plus, plus some all time. But yeah. on the other hand, That's you, you see a character like, like you a person like Fritz Rahm, and he's like, oh my gosh, my character's the same, but better, you Pretty know? Much. Just like better in every single you way. You know, let, let's also take a moment to appreciate what characters we're seeing on screen. We're seeing Pichu and Palutena. Both characters that were rightfully considered like, Pretty much low yeah, tiers in the respective bad. games. <laughs> and it's like, man, this is what I expected my top eight. I love Pichu it. and Palutena and Roy. On stage here. <laughs> he walked trying to get in. He establishes space with the forward airs, but not able to find a lot of percent. It's really good shield pressure to go for those forward airs. Look for the down tilt startup. Oh, oh god, yeah. And he's good. Of that, but and that is it. The whole light, man. Yeah. No, Which I mean, will two frame you under the ledge. Yeah, no, I mean, that that's the thing. It's like, although he was going high, even if he went for the, the ledge map, 
two frame easily possible. So let's talk about Prince. Well, this is not Prince Ram, excuse me, Palutena's ledge options. With Explosive Flame, that really, really helps with ledge get ups. Oh, yeah. You know? And then uh, Auto Rectile does. Uh, did I say that right? Yeah. No. No. What is it? Uh, uh, Auto Reticle. Reticle, yeah. It's a reptile. Uh, yeah, that's, that. the, that's a little. Yeah, something yeah, else. That's something else. <laughs> 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 but um, that's that does like twelve percent. It's pretty good. And then uh, it also can lead into up airs as well. Yep. And then oh, which and also um, side can do that too. Just sick. Yeah, that's a closer one. Closer one. Yeah. No, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, we were talking about that. Oh yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> and then um, and then you have Nair off stage, really good oh, at characters that always low. Been for that. Uh, you have the up smash that we saw there. That's when you know your opponent's going to not snap because it's it's not the same thing. Yeah. You know, everyone's not amazing with their angles yet. And then you have a uh, drop down back air or ledge trump back air. So all those things Prince Rama is accustomed to. And believe you me, he definitely knows how to use explosive flame. No, he's yeah. been showing that off nonstop all day. And he too. played customs, man. He was the god of <laughs> yeah. customs. And I heard that move sucked in customs, so he probably didn't use it that much. But you know, yeah. it's, it's Prince Rama. He was the ins and outs. Yeah, I mean, he, I, I imagine he used like uh, super speed. That's, I mean, that's what I'd be using if I was playing custom power. So this is interesting. Another winner's match. Polonian taking out... Danny. Danny. That was Danny. big, man. And the Goblin Man, we just saw him on stream. Who did he beat? He Who beat be Brand. Uh, Brand, yeah. yeah. Brand was kind of bringing it back quite a bit, but unfortunately just didn't have the correct options to come out. So this on his timing to finally close it out. But like, come on, boys. It looks rough. Yeah, it looks rough. Like, you need to confirm that advantage state, otherwise... Yeah, it's not just pretty, but you know, we're here to talk about Falco versus Roy. Definitely a matchup we're not accustomed to. If we see the Falco, he's going to go He's going to stay Falco. Falco. You know, we, we've seen him doing a few other characters uh, over at the mall. In, in he's, he's going to the bird. Like, but he, I think he really likes the bird. 